Well, can you tell me why you can't talk about it? Uh, no. I don't. I don't really know. I. I just. Um, I did something I didn't have the right to do. It was an art project, creative project. It was a social statement, um, and that's as much as I can say. I, I infringed on some things, and that wasn't uh, that wasn't legal, nor was it appropriate. So. so, to me, it was very interesting to see that there are two companies and two corporations that have the same genius in terms of branding. Can I really say no, I'm not addicted to sneakers when I'm out here at like all times of the night waiting for a pair of sneakers? So yes, you can be addicted to sneakers and you can be addicted to cigarettes. You get tired of waiting around for your favorite brand to get it right, especially when you're so dedicated. When you think of something that's colorful, you think of it being alive, having youth to it. Going back to the 80s when everybody was wearing like flashy, really bright colors. You know, we wanted to be seen bright and loud, just like these ads. One thing I'm definitely not trying to do is blend in. I don't care. I'll wear fluorescent pink in a minute. That doesn't bother me. There's this struggle for everybody to look different. But when they all try and look different, they all look alike. You know, whether you're on the golf course or, you know, you're on the corner, it's the same mission. Is that you, you want to be accepted and then stand out. I just hope that there'd be some people that just would enjoy wearing something foul on their feet like I do. So... We can move on and that's as much of that as you can have, use or even mention.